Hello, hello, welcome to another stream. Uh, we're gonna do some more MS and uh, GTRP tonight. So with that said, let's uh, pop into it. sure if I have a vehicle parked here. Oh, I do. Lucky me. I was wondering what the hell that said. Okay.
Okay, let me just clock in here. So we got one for two more because I don't think it died. a good beat to this one.
Maybe my start. <coughs> Don't be thinking about my start right here. Okay. Can I out you, boss? No, oh, not at all. Why are you pointing the taser at me then? Uh, I'm just checking the sights on it. Oh, fair enough. Oh, safety mode's on. I'm not sure, but maybe I should check and find out. Well, as long as you're not pointing at me, at me when you check it. I guess it wasn't. Okay. Um, I believe you just locked the, the hospital doors there, sir. Going Wait, Jesus! Shit! Ah! Oh, there's two people in right?
updating the time script to get here. Drops in my hand. Break by one
Okay, the city's kind of dead. I don't know where to go. I don't know where to see anybody. Howdy, howdy. <laughs> yeah, he's not moving this thing. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't think there's any way that you're moving this thing. What was that? I don't think there's any way that you're going to push this thing. Oh, I'm not planning on it. I was I was uh, doing a burnout in front of you. Oh, I see. I see. Where are you off to? A crime scene? No, I'm just uh, driving around. Not much going on. I feel it, man. Uh, wait one second. Wait one second. Don't hit my car anymore. Okay. I just, I just wanted to check out the side of your truck, man. I like fire trucks. Okay. Go on ahead. I won't. You won't hit me. Awesome okay. Car, man. Stop pointing that water cannon at me. Ah, oh, hell yeah, car walk. At least I found two people. They're right behind me. So we can hear them. We gotta exchange information! We gotta you exchange do? information! You hit me! Here, let me give you my information, man. Okay. There you go, there's my information. All right, I'll, I'll, I'll make something, make sure something happens. I have no idea what the fuck this said.
I think he's tempting me. He's daring me by standing there. Should I do it, chat? Yep. <laughs> <What are you> doing? <laughs> There's this too tempting. Trying to protect my ambulance from being squirted. That looks a little dirty. Doesn't your bus look all nice and clean now? Yeah, it um it looks a lot cleaner than it did actually. I don't know if I thought it was stuck. Nothing in the bush.
Is this your car out over here? Uh, Tempo. I thought we've had this discussion we had before about parking vehicles up here. What? No, I'm not. I haven't left it abandoned. No, but if you're on duty, you should be parking your car in the garage at the bottom of the stairs. Oh, I apologize. I thought it. Yeah, this thought, is not staff parking. Oh, sorry. I'll park in the garage in future. Like, you, you know the garage that's at the bottom of the stairs, right? Yeah, but I, I just I just see the car parking space there and I just thought, oh, I'll park there. But it's fine. I won't do it anymore. Because I was about to get it towed. I didn't know whose it was. Is nobody allowed to park there? Only patients when they come in. All right. Well, I'll I'm put still, it in the garage. I'm time. still kind of confused what the arrows are. What the what is for? This arrow. The arrow? That means... That way out, I suppose. Because there's one way in, this way, you come in, and that way is to go out. So maybe it's telling them when you leave the car park, you got to go that way to go out. Maybe. should probably turn the engine off. You know what, I'll just go and park it to save any trouble. Where did you go to put your car? The garage. No, I mean like there's literally a garage at the bottom of the stairs where you just drove off. Yeah, it's fine. I put it in the actual garage now, in the actual one. But this is an actual one. It's called the pillbox parking lot. Yeah, but I put it in the one downstairs, you know, the one in the bottom of the hospital. Okay, whatever. I don't know how long we'll, we'll stream for tonight, or if it'll be a, a long stream, we may switch to a, to a different game if it doesn't pick up a bit.
hold it for the way. My tape if I don't. I don't have any paint over there. Just a little bit of range. And now it's on me, Donkey Kong. One six four is ten seventy six. That is forty seven. And four. One six four a ten twenty three and four.
164 is plus one ten nineteen back to pillbox with one um, semi conscious female. And four. I think it's Pegasus. Yeah, probably Pegasus. Templeton didn't. You can either go for a quiff, which I plan on, or I can maybe take a shot at Pegasus. I'm pretty sure that's who you picked up. You did EMS? Send it. Hey, bro, we got a uh, new hire down here. Uh, we, we have made a... Uh, he's, he's, Got some weird things going on, so we're gonna go ahead. Are you available to run a psyche valve? Uh, sure. About that, I had a stroke while talking. I don't know what the fuck is happening to me. Are you, are you the person that needs the psyche valve? Are, are, are you the person that needs the psyche valve? Uh, possibly, but uh, this one is gonna be a new cadet, I think. Uh, ten for I'll be there in a few minutes. Um, Tommy, did you um have you got that radio call, Templeton? Because I was treating a patient, I didn't hear what was being said. And for okay, donkey. Where the fuck did that come from?
we both go to that radio call, or do you just want to go on your own? Uh, we should have someone available here in case someone else is needed. Okay, 10 4. Shoes. Shoes. Right there. One six four is ten seventy six, and that is forty seven. Oh, John. Um, back in Pompleto. Hey man, so this is uh, Templeton Peck, okay, he's uh, director Hello, of Mr. Templeton. Hello. Uh, we How are you doing? We brought him in today to run a quick psychological evaluation on you. Okay, so oh, that's fine. From you. Hell yeah. Will you stand up, doctor? No, you can stay seated. He's, he's gonna take a seat at Wayne's desk. I bet, bet, bet. Okay. You can take a seat at Wayne's desk oh. in this chair. Wayne's... Careful though, you might have to wipe a little bit of asshole sweat out of there. Uh, you get this real bad swamp ass. He got he, he got a sweaty booty. Yeah. Uh, maybe I'll just stand. Okay. <laughs> Understandable. No point of Last thing I want is a uh, swamp ass yeah. from someone else. Yeah. All right. So. Yeah, so if we're gonna do a quick psychological uh, exam, I'm, I got some cards in my pocket here. Uh, All right, man. Have you heard of the the Warshak uh, test? Is that like the ink blot stuff? Yeah. Uh, I I have heard of it. All right, so I, I'm gonna hold up uh, an image here and uh, tell me what you you see. Uh, okay, here's the first one. I see a horse riding a man. Okay, and here's the second one. I see a tank skydiving. Okay, and this one? I see a plane racing Usain Bolt on a one mile track. Interesting, okay. And this one? I see a Mazda RX-7 from Japan that was imported into Los Santos. That looks beautiful, drifting a corner in front of Benny's. <laughs> okay, and the last one? I see a horse with a basketballist feet. Okay. Uh, do, do you have any history uh, in your family of uh, mental illness or, or anything like that? Not mental illness, but diabetes, yes. <laughs> But I am safe myself. Diabetes. Yeah, I get te I get checked all the time because it's a big issue. I stay away from sweets. I eat good diet. I stay healthy, exercise a lot. Okay. Okay. All right. Let's let me t take a look at my checklist here. Okay.
it's interesting. A horse with All right, so basketball for if you were to look at a glass that's on the table and it has water in it and it is half full, uh, would you uh, say that it's uh, half full or half empty? Uh, if I walked into a room and it was already there and it was ha- I had water at the halfway mark, I would say that cup has ha- is like half full of water. But like if some if I see someone pour it, I'd say it's half full. If I see someone drink it, I'd say it's half empty. Like that gentleman's cup over there to my right, I would say it's half empty because he's been drinking out of it. Yeah. Also, you need to slow down, Barney. You you are on duty. I don't know if you remember that or not. Oh, yeah, you forgot all my stuff. Uh, dude, yeah, that that's enough. just some that's just it's apple like juice. It's like coffee to him. Yeah, exactly. It's it's my hit for the day. You know, kiss me going, mm-hmm. kiss me yeah. straight. Help you deal with these shit games around here. Anyway, uh, I'm sorry I interrupted you, Bubba. You continue. Uh, no, no, it's all, it's all good. All right, so we're, we're going to do some uh, word association now. Uh, I'm going to say a word, and you're going to say the first thing that pops into your mind. Got it. Okay. So the first word KJ. Chief. Okay. Uh, police. Five zero. One fifty four ten forty one. Captain Ball uh, about the ball. Superhero. Uh, radio. Mm-hmm. What'd you say? Radio. Microwave. Um, Irish. Alcoholic. Uh, mm-hmm. uh, criminal. Death. Mm. Money. Root of all evil. Mm. Pornography. A sin. And finally, mm-hmm. Wayne Bruce. Daddy. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. I think that's good for this. All right. I'll, I'll have to have a chat with your superiors here. We'll uh, I'll give them the results. All right, All right, thank uh, you, sit tight. We're going to step right outside. We're going to have a little chat, okay? What you think of Dippledown? All right. Um, I think he's a sociopath. Mm. Uh, but so he, he should fit in quite nicely here. Okay. Okay. So let me ask, what uh, what led you to that uh, consensus of yours? Well, he, the the Warshock test that I gave him, uh, those were pretty far out descriptions of the images, uh, which le- leads me to believe that, uh, you know, he's you know, not all all there, and that he may have some uh, other tendencies, you know, maybe murderous tendencies. Uh, I I definitely wouldn't issue him a firearm. Okay. Mm. So taser and nightstick only. Maybe if you can find like a rubber duck he can squeeze or and honk out. Candy them. cane. Yeah, that would work too. I, I actually do have one. Definitely, definitely non lethal. If you need one I can get you one. What candy canes? We have an armory full of them. <clears throat> oh shit. Oh, ow. <laughs> They don't hurt at all. They used to hurt a lot more. <laughs> I, I, no, no, they literally do not hurt. Oh, okay. Yeah, bro, Barney Harris and I got packed out, but we, we both had fucking clocks. We got packed out by one guy with a candy cane. They used to be that busted. Sounds like a scale issue. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I, I, I think he'd fit in just fine here with you guys. Okay. Awesome. I don't prescription forging report. Oh, well, I'm forging prescriptions at your uh, home base, sir, Doc. 
Yeah, it doesn't surprise me. Nancy is such a bitch. She just gives them out to anybody who asks. Yeah. Nice. She, she's the one that doesn't wear shoes, despite me telling her a gazillion times not to wear them. She's the one with the uh, nice knockers, right? Uh, no, she's the the one with the blonde hair and the pink okay, streak. Okay, okay. That's Nancy. I usually call her Little Caesars. <laughs> Templeton got it. That absolutely went over my head. Yeah, sorry. If it, you're not, uh, Little yeah. Caesars is a pizza uh restaurant, right? Where their famous slogan is one, pizza, pizza, and two, hot and ready. Five dollars, eighteen inch pizza, always ready, ready when you walk in. Yep. So that's why you know some some chicks they're just little Caesars, they're hot and ready. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. So little Caesars is like, it's similar to Taco Bell, you know. It's nobody ever just wakes up and goes, "I want little Caesars," but after you get past about tenth, mm, eleventh beer, they're like, like he's just having, "Is he having a seizure in there?" Is yeah. That... I think it's fine. I think it's good. Maybe you want to give him the check over, Templeton? Uh, we'll see what's uh, what's going on in here, yeah? No, I was pointing at that because I, I just the John Doe placard because my good friend. Uh, we thought Templeton was going to have to give you a quick uh, check over. What was that? We thought Templeton was going to have to give you a quick uh, check over. Okay. No, I, I do believe it is policy here that all new recruits have to go through a prostate exam. Oh, that's fine by me. Um, doctor, what happened oh. to your glasses? Um, I, I was hit by a candy cane and they fell off and broke. Ah, oh. did one of these guys do it to you? Uh, maybe. No comment. <laughs> maybe. I bet it was this yeah, one right gonna, here. Here, let me go ahead and I'll put them back. I have a spare pair in my pocket. Oh, no, not uh, me, not me. No, I got, I got a pair. I'm going to go ahead and my pocket to me put them on. Up. You're whispering a little bit, Wayne. So speak up a little bit. Uh, my ears aren't with Oh, shit. <laughs> shit, my bad. Yeah, yeah, it wasn't me. Uh, KJ? Uh, Barney? I, I, I think he actually candy stripped cane? and fell. I think he just stripped and fell. Maybe this guy's a uh, sociopath. I think he's lying to us all. Maybe. Me? Uh, well, uh, yes and uh, no. Dude, no, um, I'm telling you the truth, man. Okay, okay. Uh, I was actually talking about Templeton, but you got very defensive. Uh, well, what's up oh, I, I, I thought you pointed at me. My bad. Good, man. All right, bro, so here's where we're speaking, at. Man. Speaking of sociopaths, stay away from that Charlie Hughes. Yeah, he's a, he's a real pain in the ass. Yeah. All right, man. Uh, give me just a second, okay? Uh, we're going to step back out here and have a quick chat, uh, see what we're going to do with you next, right? Okay. Uh, also, sir, do you typically stand on desks during your interviews? Uh, no, I was trying to, I was trying to take a sip. It's funny. Sociopath, huh, Doc? Yep. Like, you almost have to be the, be a cop these days, no. you know? No. Wait, where are you? What happened? Uh, the guy's a sociopath. I said, huh, sociopath, Doc, huh? Huh? Huh. Oh. I don't know. Yep. That's, that's my, my medical diagnosis. Okay. I honestly think you'll fit in very well, then, like you said. You're probably going to go places, honestly. Yeah. yeah, you probably will be one of my chief deputies mm -hmm. really soon. Yeah, especially... You'll probably be uh, part of this ghost home friends quite soon. Right, when he, yeah. when he told uh, Charlie Hughes to shut up, cadet fit right in yeah that's when i knew he was solid to be like, honest like a glove honestly at that point it was pretty much fucked the idea this guy's hired you know in fact you should just give him charlie hughes's rank and put charlie down to whatever rank he is we'll make him a face to get at hmm. all right guys what are we thinking what do we want to do with him give him a vehicle Get them on the streets. Mm hmm Bicycle. Yeah, this guy has the makings of a real officer. Yeah. I think bike but... patrol around the city is uh Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, like a good start I think that'd be a good stuff. I think yeah. that's that, that's a good one. Bike patrol. Uh, taser nightstick. 
Taser, nightstick, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Bike patrol doesn't need lethal. Mm, taser, candy cane. I think candy cane just to be safe, just to uh, pass yeah, it on yeah, day yeah. one. Yep, um, yep, yep, yep. That candy cane instead of nightstick. Yeah. Actually, yeah, if I remember correctly, he brought a taser, didn't he? Temple. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, from home? Maybe. Didn't he, Barney? Uh, possibly, I, I can't remember. It could have been self purposed, yeah, potentially. Yeah. yeah. 174. One of those, 10, like, you know, army. Uh, Temp 4, welcome aboard. That's what I'm looking for. Standard issue? No, uh, army surplus. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. They're just, you uh, gotta, you like, can like, actually get them surplus. so easily now. Yeah. Gas stations sell them these days. It's crazy. Tasers and puff bars. It's insane. It's crazy. All I'm saying is I want it the Aki way. Yeah. It's more of like a bodega. It's in New York. It's a. It's like videos. People oh, come to this I guy and they're like, either. "Hey, can you make this?" And but do with the Aki Temple? way. It's a, it's a guy's. Never mind. You gotta remember, bro. Before I moved here, I've lived in Louisiana my entire life. A little bump up town called Ruston. Mm. Okay, all right. That's what it, fair enough, fair enough. Fair enough. You don't see shit around here except gang violence, okay? Yeah, gang violence. Well, let's get this guy yeah. out on patrol. On the street, yeah. uh, does anybody have a yeah. bike? I got a bike. If not, we can run him. You got one? Cool. Yeah. We'll, we'll let him put him out there since we're on that. Mm -hmm. I appreciate it, Tom Templeton. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Oh, no worries. It was really, uh, it was good insight into his mind. Yeah. Where he's at. Right, right. right. Uh, so nice to see yeah, that he's going to fit him I, I definitely hold, hold off giving him like, a lethal weapon for a little bit until he proves himself. But, uh, yeah. yeah. Just keep your eye on him. I got you. In case he snaps easily here. Yeah. Right, Damn, well, we got a squad there. right now. No? Squad? Uh, he, he, EMS uh, squad. Yeah, dude. Dang. James Baker. I wish oh, we could yeah. see EMS on our uh, GPS, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, that'd be yeah, pretty that'd dope. Be nice. it, 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 we, we used to be able to, uh, but it was abused. Of course it was. Yeah, so basically people would take the EMS job at the job center, see where how many cops were on duty and where they were. Ah. And then they'd uh, Damn, get rid of the up. job, and then they yeah, it's... That sounds about right. Yep, that's, yeah, that, that, that sounds about that right for up. sure. <laughs> checks about, oh, all right. Uh -huh. That makes sense for sure. Well, anyway, I appreciate you, bro. I'm gonna go on and get this guy. Yeah, no worries. Situated. No worries. We go make sure that uh, Griff isn't killing the rest of uh, the MS. So. Yeah. Oh yeah, that uh, that checks out too. Yeah, he's been riding yeah. around with us. Another he sociopath. Might, he, yeah. You know, yeah, exactly. That's why he's trying to. I think he's trying to join the police force. I don't know. He's been riding around. Yeah, with don't us. let him. Don't oh, he's trying to do a do a Jake Stevens. <laughs> Fuck him. <laughs> You know, Jake Stevens turned right back to daddy, though. He came running right back. Temp but did he, though? Yeah, no. No, he didn't. No, no, he didn't. I'm glad that asshole's dead. Right. Fuck him. Damn. Wow. City, wow. City morgue incinerated in my herd. on how he actually died. That sounds really excited. Yeah, that did. Yeah, apparently he went to Vice City and met some people that uh, were, not, were not good and... Sold him on some bad drugs. Probably. My city's full of that. Yeah. yeah. It's not a great place over there. Mm -mm. Too much coke wasted with fentanyl. Anyway, I think this guy's been waiting long enough. Let's get him situated. Yeah, 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 let's, let's get him out there. there. Thank you, Doubles in. You Thank you. All right, have fun, boys. All right, so I gotta find my way back downstairs. I think Alfred's on duty and. Griff and James. So. Um, <clears throat> one six four to one oh one. Send it. Uh, so basically, the trainee. Um, sorry, one second. Uh, James is having trouble. Um clocking on on the emails it's saying this application is not responding yeah it's probably uh, down so tom uh, don't worry about it i'll adjust it later 10 
One five four stone ninety mech kill box one summit nine just ten four seven. Ten four. Nobody saw nothing. Chicken kebab. Hi, Tippleton. Hello. Yep, you did. Did uh, anybody go? <laughs> Did anybody go to the call over by Postal One Seventy Eight? Uh, let me see. I didn't. I think it just came in. I'll go to it now. Six four is seventy six, so let us point seven. Why, hello. Ah. Not even say anything. This can talk club in red. <laughs> Oh, I can't do that. There we go. How are you doing today, boss? Um, uh, all right. Sneaky man. 
your head was peeking out just that little bit. <laughs> Oh man, there's not one good thing on here. One six four is ten twenty three. I know, right? Jeez. Okay, mine is probably full of red flags too. That's okay. It's super rad to be uh, matching my hair, which means it's good, right? Sure. One six four is ten nineteen. Back to pill box with I... one. To make but I, I was smile. thinking of uh, changing my hair to a. To a blue with like white tips for a little bit. I don't know. Maybe I'll do that for like Halloween and be like, uh, no, Christmas and be like Jack Frost for the Christmas. Sure. I don't know. Dying hair is too much work though. And then you, you have to bleach it first to get the right colors and then to be able to start from the lighter tone. I don't know. Hmm. So I tell you that I'm uh, building a new brain? Yeah. And what are the specs? Here, I'll send it to you. Yeah, I'll take a look at that. My pre-written reports came in handy one second ago.
one six four is ten forty two. Have a good night, ladies and gentlemen. Ten four. I just realized I can break every single one of uh, your eyes rules just by putting one thing in and all okay. One sentence. Oh, no. Wait, no. Not all. I'd have to send it in about five times to count as spam. What do you mean? Break out all the rules. Um, just so you know. Just, just so you know, Jack. Oh, right. Yeah. Just so you know, Jack, I can't um, clock out on emails, as you know. So I'm just going to leave myself clocked in and you can just. No, don't worry. I'll, I'll fix it all. Yeah, no here. problem. No problem. Have a good day, guys. Have a good one. Okay. You're going nice with the processor. You're doing good work there. No, I, I, I'm going to move the video card I have my current PC over. And then I've got a 1060 that I'm going to pop in this one here because it's just going to be a stream PC. Okay. I'm basically going all in on Corsair. So. Oh, I, I, I love the brand. I'm not going to lie. LGA. Okay, you're going with the you're going with Wi-Fi and your motherboard. Good, good man, good man. Always giving you that option. I never use it, so I'm wired for everything. Yeah, but it gives you the option for that just in case you have to move it somewhere. You can't get that cable no, access. Like the, no, my, my fiber modem is like literally a foot away from me. I can, I'm looking at it right now. It's still nice to have the option <coughs> in case anything goes wrong. Uh, you're going with 32 gigs. Okay. No, it's two four sticks of sixteen, two thirty-two get. Uh, get oh, okay. Uh, I don't see that you have it on here twice, but okay. So you're going with sixty-four then. Is that what you said? Okay. Yep. Sixty-four. That's that's a decent amount of RAM. Oh, I see. I, I didn't move. If I move down, I would have to see. Okay. Uh, you're going with one one terabyte and one two terabyte for your solid state drives. So you got the ones that go right on the board. Nice. Let's see. That is. Do you want to take the meta back for that one? Yep, I will. All right, James, let's go. I can't get it. I see you've learned from last time. Exactly where they are. There's a little side road that's right over here above the freeway. So probably up picking poppies.
This might be a little bit difficult. You can hear me think about being stuck. I right, do you want to go grab him on the road and I'll uh, bring the helicopter down. spot to land uh, put a, a bike on a tree. Okay, go ahead, pick him up and uh, put him in the back of the, the uh, medevac. Right by. One one plus one, nineteen pillbox with one down individual. You leave my bike back there. Well, I'm sure you can come back and get it once you're, you're back up on your feet. I care about the bike more. You can go uh, take him down and get him checked in. Okay. All right. So once the training is done with that trio, we'll put him in the, the vending machine and see if he can get himself out. Go ahead, flex your e-muscle. I was like, uh, that was good. You're gonna have one one beast on your hands. You you said you're gonna be moving over the thirty eighty. Yeah. Still a good car. Amount of uh memory in it yeah it's pretty decent yeah. it'll be one hell of a beast of a machine though. oh yeah that'll last you quite a few years before you need to upgrade anything the next upgrade that i could see uh not knowing your monitors or anything would probably be uh the graphics you got yeah i was thinking of waiting for the 14900k but uh, from what i was reading the the difference is very minimal okay there's like a, a plus 200 megahertz uh, increase in the in the base uh, clock, but uh, I figured it was negligible, so I just uh, stick with the 13900. Understandably so. Yeah, the...
Yeah, I mean, that's not really much of a difference. You're not going to notice it. See that you're going with the white fans. Uh, are you, do you plan on, like, I didn't see you. Were those, like, LED ones that you can change the lights on and all that? Yeah, on the part list, uh, it didn't give me the option to choose black ones, but it'll all be black. Oh, okay. Black chassis, black fans. Are you going to be, like, painting them or something? Nope. Just black. I like black. No, well, the fans said that they were... You said the the fans are going to... What's going on? I disregard it was. Yeah, okay, like I'll I'll get black ones instead of white oh. ones. I'm not gonna paint them or anything. Okay. And you're gonna be like returning the white ones then, or did you just not order the white ones? I haven't ordered them yet. Oh, okay. PDT, on you the PC part list, or it didn't give me an option to pick black ones. Send it. Yeah, we're gonna need a PMS star to a MRPD front desk. We got a, we got a hell of a situation. Ten four. Um. I was wondering, and uh, what type of transport should I use? One fifty-four sensing six delays. Uh, air, air. There should be one for the air transport. Should be like the last one on the list. Oh, okay. Okay. Okay, I got it. All right. Cool. So I'll wait until he's finished uh, his notes here.
154 is 10, so, uh, 10 19 back to a box with one semi conscious 1047. Please tell me it's Charlie Hughes. No, it's uh, Mr. Wayne. Oh, no. Hello? Hello? What's going on here? Why am I stuck? You're inside the vending machine. How? Do you wanna do you, do you wanna get some uh some sprunk out of there? Let me see. I got two now. You got two, okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna pull you out now. Okay. Ah, thank you. <laughs> No benches and no garbage. Wonderful. Hydrate. All right. Get some uh, cow juice here. Freshly squeezed from the teat. It is always good. Especially when it is ice cold. Fuck is Alfred. He is back here. Is he downstairs? Guess he's in his head.
Quiff, quiff, quiff. EMS to PD. Can I get someone to the back garage at Pillbox to impound a vehicle? Four twenty twos, um, seventy six. Uh, be right back to that. Don't worry. Hello, one fifty four to one on one. Can you impound this one? Yeah, yeah. Let me see who it belongs to, though. I'm curious. It's Quiff. Oh. Mm. I, I, I've told him God knows how many times not to leave his vehicles out when he flies out. That's a seizure, actually. No, it's not. No, it's a seizure. I'm seizing it. 154 to 101. Oh, I was curious to see if there's anything illegal. Send it. Uh, this is being seized. If you ask where it is, tell him he can uh, pick Wayne up Wayne Bruce that is going to need surgery. He has a Rip. bludgeon kneecap. And Don't forget to write a seizure report before you guys strike yourself. Yeah, I was, I was about to, actually. Do you remember the tag on that? Uh, I've already taken him for the x-ray, so we, we have Yeah. That. Queen, I'm not currently oh, Romeo, course. Papa, four four nine zero. I only have one eye. I can't do surgeries. Okay then. Do you get that? QRP four four nine zero. Yeah, got it. All right. So uh, let's do what you can up there. I'll, I'll be up in a minute. Okay. Alright, Templeton. I got you, bro. All right, thank you. See you later, Templeton. Yeah, have a good one. I don't know where the fuck they are. Surgery, maybe. No, it's impounded. You just have to go pay a thousand dollars. Hello there. Hello. Yeah, he, uh, he's starting to lose consciousness on uh, on me here. All right. So what 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 happened? Uh, he was attacked with, I believe, uh, an oversized gavel. It is. Kneecap is bludgeoned and he has a fracture, a fairly bad fracture in his femur. What, what was, was this a, a Pegasus related incident? I'm not sure. I believe that an officer was going after Moe's Dominus. Uh, okay, okay. So. Well, it looks like there's uh, some a lot of swelling in his abdomen here. It looks like there might be some internal bleeding. Okay, let's go through and we'll sterilize his abdomen okay, here. Just, uh, put him under some anesthesia here. Let's run some IV blood here. I gave him a shot of morphine. Probably should just run uh, steady supply. All right, so we need to drain some fluids that are in his abdomen here. That's why it looks like it's a little uh, distended. Yeah. All right, I think he's pretty much out right now. So I'm just going to make a small incision here. Yeah. All right, look at all that blood just oozing out of here. Definitely some internal bleeding. Oh, that got me in the face. 
it's not good. Uh, stayed away from my. So I had to apply to push a. I had to push on a little bit to get it to come out. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Let, 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 let's put the uh, endoscopic camera in to see if we can see where the the injury is here. Down his leg. Do we have a camera that can do that? No, we'll just put it through the the hole in the abdomen we just made here. View. What's going on here? No, no, it's just impounded. They they oh, wouldn't see it. Got him like that. Stomach, yeah, it definitely looks like there's a laceration to his intestine. And it looks like a little bit of a neck to his uh, liver. Is it small enough where we can just uh, cauterize it? Or are we gonna have to stitch? I uh, know. We'll, we'll, we'll just go ahead and just stitch okay. it just to make sure. And... Just get that sweat there for you. Don't want to that going in the patient. Oh, thank you. Okay, what's his blood pressure? Looks like it's 80 over 120. He's got normal blood pressure, so it looks like that uh, there's no other bleeding here. All right, so I'm going to remove the tools from the incision here. We'll pull the camera out. Okay. And then we can go ahead and uh, close up the incision. Okay, now what are we going to be uh, doing about his kneecap and uh, his decently fractured femur here? Uh, you can just go ahead and uh, just put a cast on his leg, one of the air casts. Okay. And his knee should be okay. The the kneecap uh, isn't really bone, so. Yeah. Some hard cartilage, it'll heal by itself. There, his knee should be good as new here. Yep. Blood pressure is 77 over 10 right now. His heart rate is uh, rising a little bit, but that's expected with his, his injuries here. Yeah. Let's uh, push him, so, so put some more morphine through the, uh, the IV. Will do. Oh, okay, well, looks like we'll just give a little bit more morphine. Yeah, he'll be flying as high as a kite. And he will be. Okay, I'm going to lift the seizure here. Back up. Are we good for this to be turned off? Yep, yep, yep. He, he should uh, start coming around soon here. Uh, 
Wake up. Uh. Uh. Oh, I thought I was in Candyland. Uh, no, not in Candyland. Uh, you're in, in Templeton's Land. Yeah, hell. I mean... Which, which, which could probably be just as good. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Where am I? Uh, you're in the, the surgical unit at Pillbox. Do you know your name, what sir? Happen what happened? Uh, you were beaten with a, a gavel. Uh, you received injuries to your leg, a broken femur, and a dislocated kneecap. Uh, you also had some internal bleeding uh, with some lacerations to your your large intestine and your liver. Uh, we were able to uh, sew the lacerations shut uh, to stop the bleeding, and uh, we've uh, relocated your your kneecap and uh, we've mended your bone. Hmm. That sounds painful. I don't feel a thing. Oh, that's good. You're you're pretty, you know, high on drugs right now. So, a good kind. D drugs. Yes. Yeah. You've you're pretty high on morphine right now. Don't tell any other officers Never that I'm know. high. Oh, I won't. I won't. I need to clean my hands and change gloves. Your secret is safe with us. Uh, so you will need some some time to recuperate. This was a pretty uh, extensive surgery, so uh, I would recommend uh, just taking it easy Can for a little bit. On my, uh, down chief. I just got out of surgery. Yeah, I feel sleepy. Stable. Yeah, the, the the best thing for you to do right now is to, to sleep and uh, let your body uh, finish the healing process. Okay. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you a prescription for some Oxy because it will definitely help you with uh, any pain that you may have once the, the morphine wears off. Yeah, nothing we can do about that Charlie Hughes pain, though. Permanent. Yeah, he's... Yeah, that, that, that's just the pain in the ass that I, I, I just cannot uh, fix, you know? Me neither. All right, so if you just take this uh, when you uh, get some time uh, to uh, the nurse upstairs and she'll uh, she'll fill it for you. All right, Alfred, do you want to uh, take him to one of the recovery rooms uh, on the other side of the uh, the treatment area and just uh, let him rest for a yes, little bit? I, can. I think we're going to be taking it easy. Okay, so hey, currently feeling, feeling I need to show Quiff where yeah, to actually oh, perk. I'm ready for bed. Okay. There's a parking lot right here. This is where you need to park your vehicle. Pillbox parking lot. You can pull it out by clicking or standing here, flexing your e-muscle, and it tells you what vehicles you have parked here. This is where you park your vehicle. Right here. Not up there. And not in the garage. Right here. Got that? Right here. Huh? 
Not here. Down there. Okay, he's back there resting currently. I informed him that when he's ready, he can come front here. You can check out and okay. grab his prescription. Sounds good. Yeah, he's back there. He's going to take a nap. Okay. You want a random question? <laughs> sure. Who's your favorite Norse god? Uh, I can't actually think of any off the top of my head. There's Odin, there's Thor, there's the Loki. Those, those, I guess they are Norse, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, they're, they're also Norse gods. I, I, I probably have to say Odin, because he was... A lot more powerful than what Thor and Loki were. This is true. Or Hera. See, I, I, I do like Odin. I'll give you that. He has a good story, but he doesn't have as complicated as a story. You see, I, I'm not a, I, I'm not a huge Thor fan just because he's Thor, and he has Mjolnir. Although that kind of helps, but. Uh, he has a lot of stories behind him, and there's a lot of detail in all those multiple different stories as well. Odin's kind of a little bit of a mysterious one. Which is all the more reason to uh, have him as a favorite. Yeah, this is true. Yeah, so I, I just got sent a... Quite a lot of Norse gods. Copy of... Uh, Odin is definitely good. He's very wise. You have a... An incident uh, to your name, now, uh, Kyler. <laughs> I like the stories behind Thor. There, I feel like there's a lot of detail put into them. Probably because he's one of the more well-known. Your car was definitely seized. I his stories have a lot behind. Okay, and that's my random question until I come up with a new one. Yeah, it was seized. You just have to go ask for it, and they'll, they'll let it go. There's a note in there to give it to you whenever you ask for it. Here, I'll show you. I have to sec here. Show the desktop. I think it should go the same. Okay. There, there's the there's the arrest rep, the, the record there. It's the unseized vehicle if he comes for it. There's a few stories behind it. Oh. Not sure. Hello, gentlemen. Hello, are you here Hello. to see your... What is he? Is he a he, he's, he's okay with uh, all the visitors except for Charlie Hughes. He he does not like Charlie. Uh, Templeton, uh, this is extenuating circumstances, you know. Uh, this is Sheriff John Doe. Uh, he'd really like for Charlie to be able to see. So could you make an exception just this one uh, time? Yes, I would want Charlie to see. Well, it, it, it's not my exception. That's Wayne Bruce's exception. Okay. Well, well, in that case, we'll, honestly, we'll ask him. Uh, we'll walk you back. All right, Charlie, we'll stay here. Stay right there. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> oh, actually, hey, all you guys oh, come you here. Come, come over come here. With us. Just uh, don't enter the room till we, till I ask him. Okay, that's fine. All right, San hey. Uh, PD, come here quick. We'll be right over there. Yep. Right, I'm gonna see whose baton is in the vest. I'm gonna start with you, Cadet. All right, you're doing pretty good. Let me, let me check yours now. 
Oh. I don't want to check yours. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, you guys are good. I keep that thing <laughs> on me, bro. Where are we this going? way? Oh, this is crap. Yeah. Go through the. There's two different ones. I didn't know and that. Both doors lead to the same. Oh, way. don't ever buy food for this place, dude. It's always overcharged. I actually didn't even know this crap. God existed. damn, that place is expensive as fuck. <laughs> yep. Well, it's because we got all the best food. What? I got fucking pecan pie from Yellow Jack for 50 bucks. You're Charlie Hughes. Yeah. <clears throat> I saved 10 grand That's on because my... Because Charlie uh, Hughes hates uh, uh, and they're supporting uh, local. I saved 10 grand on my V10 kit, too. Hell yeah. Wait, I want that back. That goes back to society. Okay. I thought I did it. Carl, let's hear. Dude, who the fuck's... Who has their phone on them right now? Who has their phone out? Yeah. Of course it's Charlie. Yeah, I, I get it. Fucking Charlie, send man. Send him in. Okay, yeah, he's ready for oh, guests. Wasn't even gonna now, if everyone runs right, in at go. one time, there hardly be any room, so please do so. It's going pretty Holy shit, lose your fat ass. It's alright. I'm hurting pretty bad. Watching shitty cops on TV. I feel Not like, as man. cool as that, huh? So you're watching uh, some body cam of Charlie then, huh? <laughs> Fuck, body cam's on still? What can I say oh, about this shit? It's my fucking thought. Yeah, I'm hurting pretty bad, boys. I'm not I gonna lie. Me. These guys have disappointed me today. You? You made me proud. I took a beating. You did indeed take a beating. My leg that's, broke. That's what happens when you try to fuck with me. I respect you for it, though. Yeah, I got an in incision scar in my abdomen. You, you guys better take good care of my boy over here. Absolutely. He's received the best care that we can offer. Uh, did Quiff take care of him? Good. He did Thank not. Thank God. <laughs> he would have stole his pants. Probably. He stole mine before. That sounds about right. He's got this thing of, uh, mm -hmm. what, what, you know, what, wanting to, to see the D and receive the D. So. Yeah. Dude fucking beat me up and then just left me to die. Sounds about right. By the way, I wrote a bulletproof seizure report for that vehicle. It reads, and I quote, Temple left car in pillbox garage when Templeton told him not to. Bad dog. Unseized vehicle if he comes for it. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Where's pants go? I don't know. You seem pretty first out of one it. to realize that? Yeah, yeah I'm really out of it. Would you put him on, Doctor? Talk about that good shit, huh? Uh, he's high on on morphine right now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Got a nice double dose. Don't, hey, what I need an I need that? a nose so I make sure on your next drug like right, random drug yeah. test, if mm -hmm. something pops, I can cover for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. More, I'll I'll morphine. keep you out. I'll, I'll keep you off that random drug test for a few months. Mm. Doctor, let me know once he's off that morphine. Like, once he's not receiving any more. That way, so I know when I can start putting him on a random drug test. Hmm. Okay. Well, based on his injuries, uh, he'll, uh, I gave him a few prescriptions for some oxy to help with the pain once the morphine wears off. Okay. Uh, so maybe in a month or so, he should uh, I, uh, be off We'll that. be able to see the oxy. I'll, I'll make sure it's in his medical record so we know that it's been prescribed to him and he's not just, you know, Taking them street drugs. Well, trust me, it's it's in his medical records. Hell yeah. Right, Alfred? Yeah, what he said. You know, I didn't I didn't hear Alfred. I'm just gonna believe <laughs> you, Wayne. Even though you're high as shit, I'm trusting you. Yeah. It's okay, just keep sneaky. your leg elevated. I kind of feel like we're a trunk in one of them car clowns. Yeah. Why is this room so no, this, goddamn small? This, this, this is too big for this clown cars, man. Ask them. They, uh, they yeah, called I me a fucking it. clown earlier. Yeah, which one of you motherfuckers called me a clown, by the way? Uh, um, 
Oh, we have a we have a nice big room downstairs, oh. but uh, uh, we kind of put dead bodies mm. in it. So holy shit, you guys are snitches. <laughs> you know, uh, let me see that baton you guys real quick. I mean, we uh, are cops. Here you go. You can borrow I, mine I for a second. Wanna... <laughs> Thank you. We should get back. You fucking whose out. whose baton is this? It's mine. All right. Give your baton to him. Uh, what if I don't want to? Say goodbye to your fucking kneecaps, that's why. I'd use the baton. It's, you know, it's smaller, it's tougher. Paper number. Paper number. Immediately it starts getting 21. <laughs> oh, you works, man. Go. Thank you. He has a baton. I gave it to him. Yeah. He, hell yeah. Okay. Good. You get over there, Wind? I got a baton now. Make sure you give it back to KJ. Oh, absolutely. Only, only thing I'm missing now is my handcuffs. All right, buddy. Oh, no. nice. All right. I think we should uh, leave right, Wayne so we alone. Should, we should probably yeah. let him uh, let him rest. I love you, Wayne. You Goodbye, you boss. Rest easy. I'll see you soon, man. Wayne, see you tomorrow, buddy. Did you just tackle that doctor? Yep. Air chair did, right now. Asshole. Air chair. Air chair. Right now. Uh, sir, I would like to remind you that you were just about to take this cadet's kneecaps. Yeah. Uh, it was the cadet's kneecaps I was going to take. And I already yeah, took it. Yeah. Okay. I already took oh, Yeah. Did he tackle you, Dr. Pretin? He did. Purposely. Actually, I want to press charges of assault. If you want to punch him, go for it. Hey, hey, hey. Can I do something else? I said punch. If you have a melee weapon that's not a stabby stabby, go for it. That that works. God damn, he ate shit. That's what happens when you're doing air chairs and you get tased. Yeah. You better put that taser away. We don't we don't we don't attack doctors here, man. Now we all know Charlie Hughes is a bitch, so. Vouch me, real dear, true. Senior deputy dickhead <laughs> over here, man. Look at Tim Holden with yet another base take. Holy shit. Take that fucking shit. Okay. Made a note on the chart. Okay. Alright, boys, let's go back to the station. Alright, boys, y'all have a good one. Thank you for taking care of my chief. Yeah, no worries. He'll, he'll be in good hands. It's been quiet for a little bit. What's that? Where, Where is he? Where is he? Where the fuck is he? Pass up the lane. Yeah, pull out a weapon, Whoa. pussy. Pull out a weapon, pussy. Eat that shit. Nom, 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 nom. Fucking dumb You're in time out, motherfucker. Look at him getting bitched around. Not a word that they're going the wrong way. It's not a word. Where'd our uh, training go? Beautiful question that I am clueless about. What's your uh, 20, uh, James? Uh, you gentlemen have a nice oh, night. Tell Quiff to go. Yeah, tell Quiff to, to stop stealing fucking pants. I'll pass it along. Have a good night, Albert. Albert? Albert? Oh. <laughs> Alfred. 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 Close enough. Night, Albert. Man. Take it easy. Yeah, Quiff left his uh, car parked in the. Uh, yeah, I saw that. 
Also, the garage downstairs. Well, again. Out of every... I mean, it's a decent car, but. I don't think that we were allowed to park our cars down there anymore. We're not. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's kind of an issue in the old one as well, but at least we had more room. Which is why I had it uh, looked after. Oh, impounded? Nope. Seized. Oh. <laughs> I asked for it to be impounded, uh, to be nice, but they they seized it, so. How long is that for? Oh, they'll, they'll give it back to him as soon as he asks for no. it. It's been for like a minimum of two days. But now he's got a record. Ooh. Not so Mr. Squeaky Clean anymore. Yeah. Dirty. Dirty. Terminal. There you go. Has it been slow for the most of the night? Yeah. Huh. Any chance you want to do medevac training? Uh, I, I can't leave him uh, the training here by himself. That's true. So if, like, Ryan were to show up at some point, we could. Well, I was I was thinking of going off duty, actually, so it's fine. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> see you. Yeah, have to. Yeah, stay good. Stay good. Yeah, stay good, I say. That's proper expression. I'm kind of curious. Yep, of course, Gilroy's in Caribbean Life RP. He's been for almost five hours. Oh, well, I'll give Gilroy until Sunday when I do the next bonus run. Uh, it's only a parking thing. I wouldn't worry about it. You haven't been arrested, and that's all I care about. Yeah, you haven't been have arrested. Have you heard anything you from uh, Astrid as of lately? I have not. I'm just going to be in my head for a quick minute. Yep. Uh, chat, I will you be right thing. back. Uh, listen to some music.
All right. Howdy, howdy. Howdy, howdy. Just found three thousand dollars in a tree over there. Nice. I I find like I find money in uh, this bush that's in front of my house. It's on my property. Yeah, it's. The... Was it just the one next to the hospital here? No, my uh. Uh, my house has the pool with it. Nice walled in uh, MLO. Oh, over that, there. The, the, oh, that one, nice, nice. Yeah, I, I must like drop my, I, you know, be I, I'm clumsy. I drop my wallet all the time. I must be dropping it in that bush all the time, man. Yeah, you must be. That or uh, all my missing left socks are finally coming back to be paid off, it's paying the debt that he owes me. Never gremlin stealing them. That, yeah, that could that could be it too. Yeah. James Baker, he has, have I ever been on duty with him before? I feel like I have once. No, he's he's new. Oh, okay. How's Frank doing? You you, you might have you might have been on duty with him last week because I think he had like five hours on last week. That that would make sense. That's why I would feel like I did something. Frank, Frank how's Frank doing? I haven't seen him. No. No, it says he hasn't been here for like three days, so that's not reasonable. In fact, I also I don't expect uh, to see him come here anymore. No. I, I I'd be surprised. I'd be surprised if he if he does show up. Did he do something? Uh, no. He's I, I know he's been hanging around with the wrong group of people. Mm. Uh, the the Green Gang and. I just have this gut feeling that uh, he's going to do something that will uh, make me have to fire him. Yeah. And he's already on uh, the nice with me to begin with. Thank you. What happened there? Oh, I... Uh, you didn't insult your mama? In... No, no, he, he was in here last week asking if uh, he was allowed to have uh, a weapon on him. Yeah. So I asked him what weapon, and he... Uh, what what weapon he had, and he said that he had a Glock 17, which are illegal. He was probably given that by uh, what is he saying? One of his grandkids or something like that. The Green Gang, yeah, the Green Gang. Yeah. So I I confiscated it from him, and then uh, he got written up. You planted it on. You tried to plant that on Charlie Hughes, didn't you? No, I threw it in the in the trash. I know. More thing to do. Too bad Charlie wasn't walking by and be able to just plant that on him quickly. I should have done that to you, actually. Don't do that to me. You're already trying to frame for murder. <laughs> it's okay. I, I thing is, is I know uh, what I, guns I are fine. illegal. Do you need a... I, I just said I know what guns are illegal. Do you need a like a class... Two license or something like that to carry around that shotgun, or no, it's a class one. Oh, okay. Anything that you can get at uh, the ammunition is a class one. Okay. 
That's what I thought. I just wanted to quickly check in. I just mean turning mask get by a wind turbine sound right now. Oh, is he, huh? It is legal to do so, yes. Not necessarily uh, legal to have on you uh, while on duty, but well, it, it is technically legal, but may not be allowed by EMS. It's a gray area. The only reason I have my pistol on me is because I've actually had to use it to defend EMS. So. Well, how is the uh, the taser test coming along? Uh, it's it's still coming, as in I haven't started it yet. Okay. Well, you, I remember last time I was uh, in city, you told me that you're writing a test too that never came for it. I was writing a test for what? You told me that you were thinking about writing a taser test that you never did. Yes, I am still th very seriously thinking of it. I just have not had time. There's nothing wrong with that. I just didn't know if you were like trying to update it or anything. Oh, no, no, there's nothing to update because there's no test. I have to like write it. <laughs> he just got promoted not that long ago. I think he was promoted two weeks ago. He's an EMT lieutenant. Yeah, EMT slash two. No, not Quiff. Alfred was. Looks like this uh, whip guy doesn't have nearly enough time into this week. I think you uh, should uh, give him the boot. Yeah, he's definitely slacking off this week. Yeah. Well, when, when Templeton and Phoenix uh, feel that Quip is ready for going to EMT lieutenant, you will definitely be pr uh, promoted. Yes, Quiff did. Have I, have I showed you the website I, I created to uh, store all the data? Uh, let's see, where, where do I have it?
Okay, so this is basically how I and what I use for uh, keeping track of everything. Oh, I want to unmute. Okay. This is the employee management system. So we have uh, the roster. How much money I've given you for bonuses, how much time you've put in so far. Nothing here yet. Or here. That's everyone that's been terminated. All the FTOs. People who are pilots. Supervisors. And we got the timesheets. So this is what I filled out every week. So the time that's uh, shows on the roster in the city, time in Discord, and you get uh, what your, your bonus is, if it's been paid out and when. It automatically uh, creates the table. And this is how I do all the calculations. So I just I, I just have to uh, put how much is in the pot. So I'll say like seven hundred fifty thousand. And then uh, it's depending on, so we have one person who's at six hours, so I could say give them, say, 25,000. I will automatically do the math. Nobody there yet. Uh, 45,000. Nobody there yet. So it tells me how much I need to pull out and how much will be left. All that wonderful stuff. Yeah, it's still it's still a work in progress, but I've got going back to first week of January for whoever, whoever was here. It's Gilroy, Ryan, Phoenix, and myself. Everyone else is new, pretty much. And here it'll tell me who's uh, who I owe money to for bonus. So who's been recently promoted? Who's eligible for uh, doing their EMT test? And when? Which is tomorrow for Kaz. Who's recently been hired? I don't think I have anything up there. That yeah, it's just the database. super admin so they basically on the roster I can see things that normal people wouldn't be able to see this is something I'm still working on here let's be a checklist for each of the phases so uh, as a FTO trains you on a phase they'll check it and sign off on it that let you know uh, know what you're doing Yeah, it's it's a work in work in progress.
Busy, 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 busy. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, it definitely beats the way that we were. I used to do things. Here, let me, let me show you how I used to do things. There, there's such a painstakingly process that we had. Let me see here. So we used to have two Google spreadsheets. Two Google spreadsheets. Where was it? Here, let's see if I can find it. Uh... <coughs> Bonus. That one, and then two. Yeah, so we basically had two spreadsheets here. So this is what the uh, the roster used to look like that we used to have. And nobody was ever updating it. It was just very hard to keep track of keep track of everything. So I, I ditched it. Fuck is that six four? Indeed. Who the fuck is that? Oh, well, for that was quite some time ago. Uh, so then, this is what I use for the bonus tracker. So I'd, I'd you know, go ahead, put your name down here. And then you'd scroll all the way over here. I'd populate the, the information, you know, how much was in the pot, total hours worked, uh, total hours in the week, percentage of time worked, and then the, the bonus stuff. But I, I have all the historic data going back until I started doing this and uh, it's almost a year ago. Back way back when we had uh, decent bonuses. You know, 1.2 mil in the pot. 1.5 mil in the pot. It took me a while to to go through and populate all this. Yeah, that's how I used to do things, and you know, I just decided to build a site that make it look all pretty. I was definitely not one of my flights. I don't know whose flight. I don't know whose flight it was. 
probably yours. Oh, oh I've never oh, crashed. Oh, that. I've never crashed that. Oh, that's at the airport. Let's both Which go. Airport? Which airport? Wait, why do I see the this? big why airport. Do you market it as us? Do you market it as us out? What's that? Do you market a mess out? Do you market a mess out? Yes, I did. Yeah, so I, I improved upon it. But in order for me to build that site, I had to set up a server, which I put in the cloud. I actually pay $77 a month for it. Once I once things uh, kind of settle down from the start of the semester at work, I'll uh, go back to top the top uh, and the training stuff in there. John Doe. I don't know. I don't see him. I don't see him. I don't know who it is, though. I don't know who it is, though. I should really come by another How's it going? Sounds like he was going through the catalog. Sounds like he was going through the catalog. Like he was going through the catalog. Like he blew up on him. That's unfortunate. Yeah. Yeah. No, I wasn't going fast. No, I wasn't going fast. fast. Just fucking like blew up on me. Like I blew up on me. That one's on the way. That one's on the way. You want to just get that? Or just get that? Right, we'll go. We'll send you six to it. Yeah, that's just hype. Yeah, that's just hype. This one will be. I think that the car that I think that the car that here, sped off from here and with them because this would be because this would be right here. Yeah, it's possible. 
Just take a quick look around and then we'll head out. Could ask the guy in the back. Could ask the guy in the back there if he sees any he's anything around. He's anything around this guy, so we don't miss the guy. Uh, do you see any uh, other individuals that are down around here? Me pato no. Me pato no. No, you don't. Okay. Yeah, he says the area's clear. Yeah, that car probably grabbed him. You son of a bitch. I moved for you. There you I go. I moved for you. There you go. The question is, can you get me before I jump out? Can you get me before I jump out? I shouldn't have phrased that way. I shouldn't have phrased that way. Throw me up. Throw me up before we even get there. We haven't had a good parachute. We haven't had a good parachute in a while. Paintball war in a while. No, we haven't. For shame. For shame. That was him. Oh, the Halle. Oh, the Halle. Yeah, he's a bit of a. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> He don't look like oh, he did. You don't look like he did. <laughs> no, no, he definitely didn't. <laughs> Everyone else is speaking twice. That was hilarious. <laughs> that was hilarious. <laughs> uh, oh, I know. Okay. Should fix it there. Let's carry. I misjudged how close that was. I could have made it too if it was a few with uh, like kids. Audio routing. I was routing the wrong uh wrong audio to the right wrong place. All right, sir, go ahead and uh, have a chat with uh, Nurse uh, Karen here. She'll get you all checked Thank in. Thank you, sir. Your hair is not blonde with me. What's that? Nothing. Our hair wasn't blonde when we left, but it's blonde to now. Uh, she's a redhead. What do you mean? Her, she has her hair blonde and it's like down to her chin. Oh, did he? Nice. No, like, like she's literally a redhead. There's no blonde woman here at all. I'm posting a picture. I need you to post a picture to Twitter as well. Just look at my I eyes. I appreciate you, Vontos. You guys have a good one. Yeah, you have a good one too. <laughs> Fucker checks himself in. <laughs> Autodox on. I can't believe that you have Autodox on still. You ever hear about the joke and the joke about the man that's like a yo yo? Uh, no, I haven't heard it. No? Well, the thing, it's a kind of complex joke. It kind of starts yeah, by. Yeah, it definitely um, is. Mm. Oh, awesome. I don't usually go do fishing that here. often, but I know that he walked out of a room, walked up to one of his friends. And then he disappeared. 
That's right, that's what it was. Yeah, the, the Pokemon card used to be able to get quite a few of them when you open them up, and now it's almost next to nothing. And you can't trade them or get rid of them once you have them or open them. They're just in your, your pocket. Yeah, so can I. So do I. <clears throat> I actually have quite a few of them. Yeah. Um, trying to get a hold of them at some point, but have to go fishing for that. the one day that I spent like fifty thousand dollars in packs. Okay. I got oh what was I saying? I don't know. Your your mouth is moving but no words are coming out. Mm. Okay, so I I I could go ten forty two, or if you want me to stay on duty a little longer, you could take me for a flight. Hmm. Let's see. Uh, um, how many people are in the city right now? 13. So there's 11 other people. Yeah, let's, uh, let's go do a test. Yay. Because, like, there's only 11 other people in the city besides you and me, so. Okay, well, that explains nice. why it's been a little slow. Flying up in the mountain. Was it uh, one of these ones here? Well, there's, there's quite a few houses that are still oh. available here that AOD hasn't taken over yet. I need to fly in. I need to fly out and fly back in. One second. Okay. The hunting shop, yeah. For the whole chalet. So, if you go over in this area over here, uh, there's some peyote plants you can you can get. Nice. Right over here, you can get some peyote plants. I mostly find them like all over in this area right here. They're like little cactus. Yeah, peyote. Yeah, they're like little cactus. I don't think I have any on me. Where did I put those? Upstairs, maybe. But apparently, if you, if you get enough of them, you can. Uh, take him over to Sandy Shores and make a tea and then it uh, does weird things 
can't remember if I put them in here or where did I put them. Uh, nope, not in here. I have returned. Copy. I'm just looking for something. I'll be with you in a minute. Yeah, it doesn't do that here. I think, I think the one and only time I tried to make some uh, some of the coffee or the tea, I think it like heals you continuously for a certain amount of time. And then I, uh, up in the, the forest by the lumber mill, you can uh, pick mushrooms. And there's magic mushrooms that will send you on a trip. There's brown mushrooms that you can eat. And then the red mushrooms you can uh, use to make a poison. Sup, Jonathan. Uh, let's see, where is it? Where did I put them? Uh, nope, not in here. Yeah, peyote. There they are right there. So I do have 13 of them. So. Ah, can't complain. Did you uh see this? I hope you choke while you're sleeping. <laughs> and someone liked it, so... <laughs> It's that heavy, to be honest. Because it, it just depends on how much you have. But, uh, we're all fucked now, aren't we? I'll have to have a little chat with uh, with KJ. Yeah, I, did, I didn't think they were that, that, but yeah, as I said, I'm going to have to have a little chat with him and enlighten him to his error. But yeah, I, I didn't think the fish bait was that heavy. Yeah, I don't really think I have any on me. I don't go fishing that often. Are we going or not? He's taking the stairs up. Just um, some more vehicles for you to uh, crash as soon as you get in them. Okay, I'm going to take us to the starting point and then uh, you can take over all the uh, Mark map points on the map, uh, and you'll just basically have to land there. Okay. Uh, you get you get five hits uh, to the helicopter before you fail. Okay. I think there's an actual fishing job uh, from the job center. I think it's like an activity you can just go do. Uh, but you, if you want to do it legally, you have to go get the license. Otherwise, you might get like a, a senior deputy dickhead might be coming and uh, checking on you for uh, contraband fish or something like that.
It's such a money grab, eh? And it used to be more expensive than that. It used to be like $7,000 you'd have to do every week. Same thing with the hunting license. Hell. Yep, that's all the way back in the city. Yep, alright. Uh, we'll have to do this uh, after that, I guess. Mm -hmm. See how quickly we can get there. Yeah, it's, it's not too bad, uh, as long as you can get a good amount of fish. You know, the odds are forever in your favor. I can't actually remember how many times I've taken this. I feel like I've only taken this up two other times. Yeah, I think about two times so far. Yeah. Maybe that's why, like, maybe it just leaves so I can re-go through all the certifications to make sure I'm still up to date. No, that can't be it. That doesn't sound right. You do have your pilot's license, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Got my rotary. Yeah, I, I saw that, yeah. Got it for free. Still took the test, but yeah. Okay. Alright, so it's, I think it's right over this corner here. So I gotta bring in. Yeah. Kind of ironic that he uh, passes out by a hospital we don't use. I didn't even think about that. I forgot that was there. Some nice building plans for it uh, on the interwebs. Yeah, I mean, there's there's a lot of building plans for a bunch of different ones that we don't use. Pretty much for all the ones that we don't use. The only thing one that I wish that we had was uh, one up in Sandy. Yeah, that would be nice up there. All right, I'll wait for you here. Yeah, uh, the city's harmless. No one will hurt you. <laughs> I'm too far away. Use gas pump.
I'll just refuel from back here. Yeah, that, that, that's real realistic. Oh wow, they're not supposed to strip pockets anymore. You're not allowed to do that. Alright, let's try this again. Sounds good. I think the only thing you're allowed to take out of pockets now is cash and weapons. Everything else came. Well, the first way, way one back. I ever did, we took off from Polita. Could be a mistake. Uh, usually all the ones I've done, uh, I always start them in uh, Sandy Shores. Yeah. Maybe we just flew up there at one point. <laughs> I don't know, I remember I used to just stand yeah, that, I just recently changed it because of the, uh... Oh, that. Whatever the fuck the, the gray group was, the... The LSG or... The toxic ass hats. Try doing this in a normal helicopter, you get blown out of the sky. I think I should do that one. Let's see, the thing is that Alfred's not an asshole like you are. <laughs> We just totally took out a bird. Nice. <laughs> I was for one second. What did you hit? I heard something. Bird. Uh, <laughs> sitting here, I, 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 I literally look out the window for one second and I look back and. <laughs> Screw the birds. All right, so uh, don't take off. Let me put the first marker down. Okay. Do, 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 do. Let's go. All right. All right, waypoint has been set. You may proceed. Okay. So uh, not only uh, are you going to be practicing landing and awkward spots uh, flying through turbines you also so. you, you, you also need to show me what your judgment is like as well okay. judgment how Uh, it's basically, I, I just need to use your judgment for certain things. Yeah, you, you, usually what I do is I have my my M button mapped to a key on my mouse. That marker one. All right, let me go ahead. We'll set the the next marker okay. here. Oh, you want me to go first? Uh, no, just wait here until uh, I put the marker down. Where is it? Oh, here's one. Oh, yeah. 
Where was I? I, I was right over here, the hard part, wasn't it? Uh, Javan, that I tried to get you to do. Pretty sure it was here. Okay, try that one there. This will be a, a judgment test here. Test of his judgment to see whether it is safe to do so or not. And whether he actually does it. This one seems, looks like it's over at the power station. I think it's right here, maybe. Yeah. on top of the silo or somewhere in particular over here all right so here i want you to uh see, see the uh transformers here mm -hmm. there's the uh scaffolding above it and all yep. that i want you to go between the transformers and the scaffolding that oh in between these two sets here no i want you to fly through the uh, above the transformers but under the scaffolding above the transformers but below the scaffolding yes is that even high enough Can you tell me uh well, the wings are on the, the blades go too far for that even. The blades are too far out to even try anything like that, and plus that could risk taking out the power. Good, good. See, this is the, the judgment part I was telling you about. Oh, okay. That, yeah, that's new. So you're using your judgment to tell me that this is not a safe landing area? Nope. Not at all. Okay, good. All right, let me put the next wave away. Okay. All right, so let's go and do... i to take that up there. All right, next waypoint. That's north. I doubt that's in Sandy. That's either Polito or Chile. Chilean. Yeah, the uh, Redwood Forest run, it's, uh, it's on the list. After okay, this, we're going to uh, have to stop the gas after this landing here. Okay. Now, where do you want me to land I, up on Chile? Uh, somewhere up here where it's safe to land. Preferably as close to the uh, the marker as you can get. Okay. So yeah, put some fuel in here. Is there fuel here? Oh, you're having a jerry can. Okay. 
We have a uh, little less than half, so we can make it to Toledo. Oh, I don't have a jerry can anymore. Weird. It shows a full tank for me. Uh, What's it show for you? I mean, look again. Full tank. Yeah, it says the tank's 100%. Interesting. Do you put anything in it? Alright, let me set the next waypoint. Okay. Uh, there's a very little. Uh, hmm. Next waypoint set. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, of course he would say that, yeah. So for this one here, do you see the uh, kind of the structure that's right here? It's got no roof on yeah. it. Yeah. Uh, you're gonna fly through the structure and out the other end. That is not possible. This is possible. It, it, it is possible. I've done it many, many times. This one here, right below us, to the left. Yep, the one right below us. Yep. This isn't like one of those moral tests. Oh, okay. The opening is big no. enough. Yeah, so go, go, go from the other end. It'll be easier. Okay. It is a tight squeeze, but uh, it, let, it lets me know that you can uh, maneuver the helicopter in tight spots. Just remember the five hit rule. But it, it, it will fit. No, I, I use a keyboard or a, a controller. I don't use the keyboard. It's the only thing I use a controller for. Okay, good, good. Was one hit. Yep. Slightly brushed it. Almost got it clear though. Okay, next waypoint set. Alright. Okay, this is past it, Kudo. Hey, look, it's Felix's house. I find it uh, difficult with the keyboard to use the num keys and the, the W A S. Just wondering, keys. so so what hit uh, in your eyes? Because I know that our eyes can be out of sync sometimes. For me, I just like slightly brushed the pen against the. Wall. Yeah, the the rotors hit the ground. Yeah. Remember, it was like on the first test or second test or something. It was the back of the chopper hit a hole somewhere. Uh, in your eyes. Yeah, I, I know I hit it there. Just try. Is this going to be landing in between the two lanes? 
He will be, yeah. Set that waypoint. Yep. I'll go to Hamilton Geod. All right, next waypoint. I came up the uh, up this road in the helicopter the other night there, and this this, this here uh, showed up. I was like, "Where the fuck did that come from?" I like that part they added uh, uh, going through that building at the Plato. Yeah. How did you come up with that, or did somebody bring it up? Oh no, I, I was uh, looking for. Parts for the test the one night, and I was just trying things. Okay. See what would stick to the wall, you know. Do you remember when we tried that uh, construction hole that goes into the, the ground there? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, I got it down. I don't really get it back up, though. Margin of error for that one. I mean, you, you, you hit the blades no matter what. Even with the, I think we tried it with the Sparrow. Plus the, the the one C helicopter that would make it the havoc. Oh, the havoc. Yeah. Okay. Uh, which helipad? The main one or the front? Yeah, the back one. The one that is at the stern. Luckily, we do have permission to land on this helicopter or this uh, yacht. So. Uh, we did last time. Is this one not is yours that... anymore? Yeah, it's still okay. That's why I said we have permission. Yeah, I, I just figured it was yours this way for the landing. Um, I don't know if it was right. You've had this one for quite a while. Yeah, I've had to buy it a couple times. But, uh, next waypoint set. Okay. You still own Parsons, I'm guessing? Oh, yeah. There hasn't been, like, another uh, big wave since the last one that I was here. No, no, there hasn't. Thankfully. Yes. There are a lot of yachts, yep. Yeah, I've, I've owned uh, Parsons basically since the big tsunami. Yeah. No, I remember uh, a lot of us helped uh, fish in for that as well. Oh, yeah, yep. You made me broke, how dare you? Well, it's well worth it, I, I still have it. Oh so. yeah, you're still on it. That's good. This is a... Is this Meriwether or military controlled area? That's one of the items. Are we good to land here? Yep. Talking about clearance on the last one. Okay, good, good, okay. Let me set the next waypoint. Yep. Alright, this is where it gets fun. Alright, so the next waypoint you're gonna go to and you're gonna stop and hover. Okay. And then I will explain what we're what we're gonna do. Searching by the point of this, I'm going to guess that we're going to be going under the bridges. We are, yes. Sounds like a blast. I think this was for the last test. 
Maybe I just. I sometimes I, I I may or may not do this for fun. I mean, who would ever do something like this for fun? All right, so we're gonna go through uh, all the bridges underneath them, all the way up the channel uh, until the last one. Uh, the channel you near like the one heading north. Box. Yes. Oh, yes. Uh, so don't uh, drown us, and uh, don't hit anything. Uh, yeah, sounds good to me. The drowning, I don't think I've landed a helicopter in water quite some time. These waves are fairly high. Including this one, uh, not this coming one, but the next one. All of them, all of them. Everything that I get you to do, I've personally done myself, so I know it's possible. Oh yeah, I know it was possible, I just want to track it. I don't think you've done the one up there by the left. Thing is how the chopper won't really fit. Although if you did do that, that would be very impressive. All right, that's good here. Just uh, hover here, also the next waypoint. Okay, can do. Oh, we're we're gonna need gas for it. And just swing by pillbox. Yeah, you just throw them on top of the pillbox and we'll fill up. Yeah, it definitely does. That was basically put in for uh, for PD for when they're doing air one chases that they have to refuel frequently, but it sucks for everybody else. What was your plan all along? You just wanted me to stay on for longer. Damn, you got me. Alright, let's go to the next waypoint and you'll we'll stop and hover. Okay. I can try having my parachute on me. I remember, I think it was my second test, that last part that we just did, the back rear of the chopper just tapped the bottom side of one of the bridges. And the first one... Yeah, that's possible. I, uh, the back tail, in your eyes, bumped into one of the wind turbines. I think I've gotten one mark on every test I've done. Which 
I mean, in total, I don't think it's that bad. No, it's not, not too bad at all. At least you haven't crashed it, which uh, some people have done. Mm. Do, you remember, do you remember Maven? Yes. She crashed it twice. I, I remember that. <laughs> Two different attempts. All right, uh, is this the right one? Yeah, this is okay. So uh, what we're going to do here, the big bridge, you're going to fly underneath it as fast as you can through the canyon and all the trees. Okay. Uh, under this big bridge or under, I think there's like two or three? No, the, the big bridge just straight ahead here, the train Okay, bridge. just that one and then stay as close to the water, yep, yep. go fast. You just go fast. Okay, sounds good to me. Let's go land back at Pillbox. Uh, that's the end of the test. Okay. I always enjoy doing that last part. That's possible, yeah. Those last three trees, though, those are always the, the tricky ones. Yes, they are. Putting it away when we land? You are, yes. Nice weather for the test. Yeah, it was pretty good. Yeah, the trees are pretty sick. In fact, I wish there were more of them around the map. Like, especially, like, uh, along the, uh, the, the uh, Los Angeles freeway over there. Yeah, I definitely need to get my helicopter back. There's nothing just like hovering up here and just looking over the city. Looks a lot less chaotic from up here. Yeah, the Park Harmony would be a good, a good spot for trees. They'd probably kill everybody's eyes though. Probably got a point off because I didn't eject Ocedo yet. Yep. <laughs> oh, that, that's not part of the protocol? No, no, it definitely is not. In fact, I'm pretty sure that'd be an instant failure. Oh, yeah, 100%. Unless I'm that in the past like receiver. Seven hits. Huh? Se uh, seven hits? Okay. Yep. Than See, for me, I have it saved to a, a stream deck key, so this is, it's really easy for me just to press that. This is the last part of the test that get, got Maven both those times. Uh, no, it was the first part. <laughs> but basically, she didn't get very far into it before she uh, huh? she crashed the first time. I think the second time she was going up the channel. Mm. Interesting that she got by the final part, or did you not give her the final part? 
Oh, she didn't get to the final part before she destroyed the helicopter. Oh no, she wait, she never passed it? Nope. Oh, okay. I thought that she got by, by it at one point. Nope, nope, she didn't. We, we had to wait for the helicopter to get fixed, uh, both of them that I have, so... What, uh, let's see. What was the hard part that you added on to Jake's? Well, I, 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 I had him do a whole bunch of stupid shit because he was an asshole. Uh, I remember hearing about it. I remember when he went and left, when you and him left to go do the test. That was when he came back. I like, <laughs> that, that was fun. The cocky asshole, so I gave him a test worthy of a cocky asshole. Yeah. Well, congrats, uh, you have uh, achieved the ability to, to use the medevac chopper. And that is my third time getting one hit on the medevac. I don't know if I will ever get the rotary untouched. That rotary, okay. Thoroughly surprised. I thought for this. Let me update sure. your records here. Okay. What, you're going to add fired onto there as well? Yes. Just wanted to make sure you're covering all the bases. <laughs> um, if I want to do what? Documents, public documents, affirmation tool. And I need to go. Let's see, where is it? EMS flight certs. I value affirm that Alfred. Let's come with the There you go. Ooh. Screenshot. Nice. Since you've become director, have has anyone else given out any tests for that? For what? For Medivac. I'm the only one that can certify at the moment. Oh. Okay, well, have a good one. I'm gonna be flying out. As am I. It's a little, a little past my uh, my time here. <laughs> but worth it. Oh yeah, hundred percent. One fifty four, ten forty two. Ten four. All right, so I need to mark it in the other roster now. That he's a pilot. Okay, I, uh, I clocked out at 1244 EST. The uh, application still down. Sure. Uh, that's fine. I'll, I'll fix it yeah. later. Alfred, you must do tenant. He's a sub role pilot. Date. Okay. New note. Certified for EMS. That note. Okay.
go to Discord, go to Motions, at please congratulate Lord on the dramatic work at the back. Okay. All right, so we're going to go for two more minutes to do a four-hour stream tonight. I'll go make sure I've got uh, all the vehicles are no longer out. That looks good here. What do we have in sit here? One cop, one EMS. Yeah, it's almost uh, one o'clock in the morning and I do have to go to work tomorrow, at least for half the day, because I have uh, physiotherapy I have to do tomorrow afternoon. Yeah, at the East Coast, yep. Well, nothing happens in the future. I, you know, I, I honestly, I never once thought of uh, fucking with you. But the, the best person to fuck around with with that there is Quiff, because he's so he's so gullible. Yeah, I should, I should have. Yeah. yeah, it would have been funny for him to, to do that, yeah. Look how strong my heel is. Better turn away. Let's fucking go. Yeah, let's fucking go. Two for one, nice. Yeah, you have a good one. Alright, so we're at a solid four hours. Now let's go clock off. We'll, uh, I don't know where my helicopter is. My helicopter at right now. Uh, he's been killed bad. Okay, we can do that. Well, well, well. Look who it is. All right, that one was a tie because we got each other at the same time. <laughs> hey, that's one for me. Yeah, yeah this is Ryan. Yeah. How's it going? It's all right. Not much. Just try to get some hours in before Sunday. What is it? No, it's yep, 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 Sunday. Yep. Sunday, Sunday night when I do the the bonus. 
Let's see how many more I've got. Oh well, 400 minutes. They're getting there. I've, I've got oh, over 10 hours of it now, so I'm, I'm good. So I've got, I've got to need probably an, an hour and I'm five hours away. Should be able to get it over the weekend. Oh, that's right. oh yeah, totally, totally. So is there any update on uh, Quiff? Uh, not surprising, he got asked. About Quiff, what, what about Quiff? He's got six, 69 hours, uh, minutes, 690 minutes. Yeah, he's, a, he's just a little over 10 hours. So I'm gonna add to 10 or 11 hours. So I'm far. surprised I, I keep getting emails that he's clocking in and out, in and out. Well, I'll, I'll have to you know compare that with uh, the Discord bot and we'll see which one it is. But so far, it's pretty, it's been pretty accurate. Oh yeah, no, I'm not, I'm not saying it's it's not accurate. It's it's time not accurate. I'm just trying to say I'm kind of impressed, but at the same time, kind of concerned that it's been clogging in and out like every few hours. Uh, I think he's trying to put time in because he's not going to be here for two weeks. Oh wait, when was it again? Yeah, he's uh, he's going on a big boat. Ah, uh, on the Mediterranean. Going to the yacht. Alfred is yeah, it's redhead. Yeah, he didn't invite us. Uh, and that's he's, mystery. Uh, he's. he's uh, I I bet he he booked the entire yacht, and he didn't invite us. Probably. We we've, we've got to see ourselves. You never know, he might find on a yacht, enjoying himself, bring all the champagnes without us. All right, chat, you guys are going to get a few, a little bit more with. Uh, How do I get this iPad off me? I'm not going to go off quite yet. So you got me for a little bit more. Maybe another 15, 20 minutes. All right, how's your night been? It, it, it's been pretty dead tonight because there's not many in the city. Can't say I'm surprised. Kind of expected for a weekday. Oh, because but besides besides you and I, there's only seven other people in the city. Wait, really? Yeah. So between you, I, and and the lone police officer. Oh, I, I'm uh, just looking uh, at you. Know, yeah. That that, that, that that makes it six. So. Yeah. So I, I, I honestly, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be surprised if you don't stick around that long, because I, I don't think there's going to be that many people around. Uh, I'm probably just trying to get an hour in today. Yeah, it's really low for being one o'clock in the morning. Yeah. Yeah, and Quiff is, uh, I'm not sure if he's still in here. Uh, so Quiff is Kyler's place. He, I'm not sure if he's still in here or not. Yeah, that was a long time ago. I, I, when I first joined the city, I think max population that was supported was 32, maybe 64. I can't remember at the time. But on, on average, there's like 32 to 35 people. Yeah, I know. I've got to go and add the uh, the updated bots into the ban list. I did it not too long ago, but they they keep come up with new names I'll try and do that tomorrow when I'm have a, have a little bit
Yeah, I know, right? So uh, Alfred uh, has his uh, chopper license now. Oh, well. he did. Yeah, we did that tonight because not, not like there's anything else to do. Nice. How did it go? He passed, unfortunately. Unfortunately? I thought it was supposed to be a good thing. Do you not want him to pass? Not really. <laughs> did you kill him then? Uh, I, I I definitely made it known. Well, well, what what you do with him? What, what kind of test did he go to? Was it the same one as mine? Uh, it was slightly different. Yeah, Tell I, me, I, how I was different? playing Starfield the other night. Because I know mine was pretty. I forgot to put it back. Pretty intense. Try to go through the train tracks. And then he died. I don't know what that exact day. Yeah, each each test is different for each person, so you, know, you can't go and uh, you know tell the next person before they do it what's going to happen. Mm -hmm. Gotcha. So, um, we had to get, uh, uh, FBI agent Dan Cole to, uh, clean your mess up out, out there on the sidewalk. My mess? What kind of mess? mess? Yeah, your mess. Your mess? Uh, the shit that you left on the sidewalk? Oh. That one mess. Yeah, yeah, I... He had to clean it up without any gloves on, Ooh. and then he, and then he, he smeared his hands on, hands on uh, I, don't, I can't remember who it was, Wayne Bruce maybe, I can't Wait, remember. Wait, who, who cleaned up? Richard Dangle. Oh my. Wait, Rick Dangle? Yeah. Oh my goodness, and then he was, he got it smeared on. Yeah, he, he wiped his hands off on someone else. <clears throat> oh my goodness. I can't imagine. Yeah, it was, uh, I, I, I really don't know what the fuck you ate, but it did not smell nice after three days. <sighs> yeah, it's a stethoscope, yeah. See, for me, it's a little bit different because it, uh, I was surprised it wasn't clear. Kind of looks like it's when a tsunami hits. Cool, but... Is that how strong my third is? Yeah, it it, it definitely did not get did not get washed away. Definitely survived a few tsunami. That is one hell of a turd. It, it's a super turd. Yeah, stuff is. Maybe cool. I have had super powers, but instead of no, powers, no. I've got turds. That'd be kind of interesting to see what, what GTA 6 does with a lot of things. To save the city. But thankfully, my the new computer I'm Just gonna like, should hopefully be able you to... You know how no my turd doesn't get washed away? Maybe I could smear it on somebody else. So they stick like their like ground. Charlie, like Charlie Hughes? Yeah, we, I can stick it. He can stick himself to any surface. And no matter what, the tsunami is not going to be a problem. Yeah, that, 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 that's the build I'm planning on. We could probably start with Charlie. Let's we'll see how it goes. He seems to be the perfect candidate for it. Yeah, yeah I, I really think we should start with Charlie and end with Charlie. And only do Charlie. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. It wasn't the 1660, wasn't it kind of like a stopgap? Uh, I was just speaking about it. With all the silicon shortages. I think you could be 
you could have a super tit as well if you just follow my diet of healthy salads with milkshakes. Nothing more, nothing less. I'm I'm obviously not gonna buy Windows Eleven. I'll uh I'll just get a free copy of it that I have through work. In fact, you can install Windows 11 and use a Windows 7 key or a Windows 10 key, and it'll activate. And then I'll, I'll be putting my 3080 into that build. And then the computer that I'm on right now, I'll put my 1060 back into it because it, it, it doesn't really need to. Yeah, I, 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 I'm pretty sure I remember reading somewhere that the 1660 was like a a refresh or like a stop gap to, uh, in between uh, models. So sixteen Yeah, so 1660 came out in 2019. Yeah, that was one of the reasons why I waited for a little bit. Plus, it was really hard just to find them to begin with because all the the miners were gobbling them all up, and they were super expensive. I, I managed to get on a waiting list for a 3080 through, what was it, Newegg, I think I got it from. And I managed to snag one for like eleven hundred bucks, which for a thirty eighty at the time, like the four four thousand series wasn't out yet, so it was you know, one of the top of the line that I could get. Yeah, the 2070s, 2070s, they were definitely a workhorse. All right, Ryan, I think I'm going to call it. Uh... I'm standing here falling asleep, so. Uh, don't burn the building down. You know I would, and I can. Yeah. And and if Sally starts uh, looking at you wrong, uh, yeah, that's what she just tase her yeah, ass. Yeah, that's what she did. Wait, where's, but, uh, where's uh, Nancy? If, if Karen or, or Nancy uh, come on duty, tell them... Uh, to keep up the good job, uh, they they were doing pretty good. But it doesn't today. seem like she's doing a good job. She's not here for me. Yeah, I think she's on break right now or lunch. Really? Uh, I didn't know they got lunch.
I thought this. Yeah, was... new new labor laws. Yeah. Oh man. All right, I'll I'll make sure to to let me know. And uh, make sure that uh, whatever delivery is coming for you, that you just take them home immediately. I don't want to see them underneath the desk here. I assure you, there will be no more deliveries. Hey, wait a minute. What's this in the shredder here? Let me take a look here. I think you should need some rest. You say you're falling asleep, right? I personally escort you to the clock off. Good enough. But get it clocked off now. No, 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 no. You're not, you're not going to try and get me out of here. Look what I found inside. Oh, um... Are you hiding in different spots now? No. Well, the, the, how long would it take you to smoke uh, uh, it? Are, are you sure those are what you think it is? Did you just grab a few shredded papers? And then just no, let no. me hold up. This a, is a, a small, a small burger of weed. It says, says two Ryan Johnson. Johnson. I'm pretty sure it looks like a sh compressed shredded paper. From Mr. From Mr. K. Mr. K? Mm -hmm. Who's Mr. K, and why are you? Why is he delivering weed here for you? Um, I will. I will. Um, see that? That's here, right here. It's like finely packed little buds. Um, what strain, what strain is it? Is it uh... Um. Um. So those S8 motherfuckers? Yeah. <laughs> uh, you uh, flexed the wrong muscle there? Yes, I did. <laughs> well, um... I'm not sure how, but um, Sally seems to be. Um, I think she misunderstood that I was trying to take a look at the product. She, not sure how she she dragged me in. She got my name in the system. Even though I've got no injuries, that's ridiculous. Motherfucker. He just did it again. <laughs> God fucking damn it. <laughs> oh my god <laughs> well at least you checked in with uh, my brick yes yes So you can uh, smoke it uh, with the the uh, the oxygen pumps right here that are that are going and totally unacceptable. She just built me three thousand again. Should probably go turn her off, eh? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna shut down the computer she's running on. Also, I'm gonna pull the plug. I'm gonna shut the computer down. Go fuck's sake, could you stop 
kicking me in and stop sending me bills that I do not need treatments for. Yeah, we, we stopped that. Almost at 700,000. Yeah, that's what you get when you, how do you feel if you get built 6,000 for nothing? Doesn't feel good, right? Yeah, that's what I thought. Now you better do your job properly before I put your head in the shredding machine. It's not very nice. Bro, sometimes you, you can be nice if okay, but, people but, 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 repeat their mistakes. In a, in a here. I, I'm pretty forgiving for for timers, but you know, if you're gonna repeat the same mistake, that's that's not acceptable. It's like you're not learning. Wait a minute, what what's this? Ryan, really? Um um, um, where else do you have these hidden? Um, just this two. You're sure? So if I look around elsewhere, there there won't be any more. Yeah, there won't be any more. It's just these two. Oh, what, what, what's this in, this in the box behind the photocopier here? Nothing. Papers? Nothing, huh? Nothing, huh? Let's have another one hidden behind the photocopier. You think you can just run away from me? Take your, Take your damn weed. You're not gonna be alive. Where did he go? I think he's still up there. Oh, I saw you all right. God damn it. They always say it. if you can't see your oh, if you can't see your enemy, your enemy can't see you. Oh, uh, I definitely saw you. I, I can't see you now. Break. I, I, I can hear you. I think maybe uh, you're, you're in the upside down. So wh wh where else do you have a weed hidden? Could you carry me real quick? It's getting tasty the nuts. Absolutely fuck mine. There we go. <sighs> so wh where else do you have bricks of weed hidden? 
over here. No, no, no. Wait, no, what, 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 no, here. What, 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 what is this behind no, the, the, the vending machine? It's not in. It's not behind the vending machine. No. Oh, really? Uh, it, um. Yeah, you you found it. I was about to show you that it's a uh, special code you could enter on the spunk to get one. So you've hidden them inside the vending machine too. Well, I. Let's see, where else do you have any hidden here? You have any over here? No, I don't see any here. Oh, what's this? Ryan, really? Do you have these things like hidden all over the place? Look, to, to be fair, let me show you something really cool. I was going through Banjo's clips last night. Found a clip where some guys are running around with massive. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think, I think you can still do that. And of course, the F3 key doesn't work. Wonderful. Oh, what is it again? Uh, Five, six, one, three, nine. Is that one? And then there's. Oh, oh what is it? Ah, oh, eight. There we go. Ryan, why did you have this uh, in the corner over here? Whoa. Is this what you do when no one's around here? You hide pot plants. I'm not it's sure. It's just out in the open I'm here. I'm not sure how you found that. Um, did, did you have wood dales? I, I thought it was supposed to be here. It smells good, but uh, not you could the, lobby, the lobby's not a, a good spot for it, yeah. I mean, I, I thought it, it helped with uh, some sort of uh, some, some some sort of uh, sense that could help with relaxation, you know, when before people get into the treatment room, some people get pretty bad anxiety. Uh, I figured that this might help. But it is a good thing nobody's noticing it yet or taking it out. And smoking it. Hey, but guess what I got? Anyway, five eight one three nine one gets you a block from this punk. Pretty cool trick, huh? Yeah, it is pretty cool. Wait, hold on, I just got a notification. <laughs> oh, no way, you just put it on <laughs> the... Come on, why'd you put it on there? It was supposed... Why not? Why not? It was supposed to be a secret. Nobody's not going to know. Now they know, now everybody knows. Everybody's going to be taking up, they're going to be smoking it. It's not going to be good. Most man is a disguise and it helps. Yeah, see, that, that, that's that's where I found it from. 
Well, isn't isn't this a good place? It's... No, it's right in the corner. Nobody's gonna pay attention to a corner plant. No. Well, I, I mean, I mean that's 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 true. Yeah. And it, and it helps. It helps. You know, and the sense kind of likes people around, sitting around the waiting area here. I mean, at least he, 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 you've got to agree with me on this point. It definitely helps with the relaxation. The please, few relax. please tell me you're not, you know, distributing yeah. it to people who come. Oh, no, here. absolutely not. I don't distribute. But if if they were to trim it off, that is not on me. I definitely account for that. But well, it looks just the way as it is the day I placed it, so I don't think anybody tripped it off. Yeah, I'd say there's lots of them hidden around. All right, well, when I come on duty tomorrow, I'm going to go around and, and find all the bricks wherever you have them hidden. And... Uh, Hopefully there's not enough to, you know, to come up with one of them big bricks, you know. So, you know, if you're smart, you would, uh, you know, get rid of all your bricks wherever they're hidden tonight so I don't find them, you know. Because I, I would hate to have to get, uh, you know, the canine dogs in here to sniff around. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I will definitely um What the f Ryan, really? Um Alright, to be frank with you, I did not place it there. I think the genders probably took it from somewhere else. It was hidden amongst the toilet paper. Nah, I definitely placed any here. I, I, we, we might have to question the janitor because I think... Ryan, Ryan, you are the janitor. <laughs> I'm waiting for an explanation here. Um, I mean, at least you, you found it as a full brick, not like trimmed off. I guess that's a good thing. Stop oh, right, so, so how many of these bricks are there? Because I've found like five of them so far. Um, I, I don't think it's a very appropriate question to be answered now. But it will be, it will be less than ten by tomorrow. Well, I, I should hope there should be less than zero by tomorrow. We can make it zero. I mean, I can make it zero. Okay, well, why, why don't you take this one and uh, go go and dispose of it? Dis dispose? Yeah. Yeah. I think I'll dispose it downstairs. Okay. Well, no, I'll, I'll definitely be finding more tomorrow.
101's going uh, 10.42. Yeah, 10 <laughs> <laughs> He's down there smoking it up. <laughs> oh my god. Oh man. It's because that Ryan's uh Always up for me ribbon on him like this. All right, so who all has on duty? The bot is down. okay all right chat i'm gonna call it here uh thank you everyone for joining yeah, i do have an eye patch yeah that's uh, uh an ems medic uh jake stevens uh, and i were sparring one night a long time ago and uh, I, I did not win and uh, he shattered the orbital bone above my above my left eye, which uh, caused my eye to pop out. And then Jake Stevens, being the asshole he is, uh, he stepped on it. So yeah, Templeton's got one eye, and Jake Stevens is an asshole. Hence was uh, was born the, the asshole command. Yeah, but the the, the eye patch kind of makes Templeton look like a a badass. You know? It's his signature look. Where's the, the hell is that? Um, shut uh, load. Um, why is it loading me? Can't remember what it is. What was that? Something does it. Ah, oh, interesting. Yeah, you don't really get to see my face that often because it's normally this way here, so. <laughs> All right, we're going to call it a night here. So uh, have a great night to everyone who's uh, still in here. And we'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.